King Records, that's Putin's fault. There's no baby formula. Come on, man. He's not a mind reader. They botched Afghanistan. We left hundreds behind enemy lines. Marines died. Billions of weapons left there. But no one in the administration was fired. Blinken, Austin, Milley, they're all still there. Jerome Powell flooded our economy with funny money, missed inflation. Did Biden cut him loose? No, he rehired him as Fed chair. The administration didn't see Delta or Omicron waves coming, was short on testing. Fauci's still hanging around. Is the doctor still in quarantine, by the way? COVID must really be doing a number on him. And how is it that the French lady still has a job? So um, the board has never convened. Uh, it, uh, so that's, it, it never convened and, it, and the board is, uh, is yes, the board is, uh, is, is pausing in the sense that it will not convene. The more your job, the more job security you have in the Biden administration. Nobody fails up like the Secretary of Homeland Security, though. There has never been more illegal border crossings under any administration in American history as there have been under this president. How the hell does Secretary Mayorkas still come to work and collect a paycheck at this point? Even Mayorkas can't believe he hasn't been given a pink slip. You know, the only people in the Biden administration actually doing their jobs well were these Border Patrol agents on horseback. Back in September, a shanty town of Haitians, 30,000 strong, formed under a bridge in Del Rio, Texas. Think about that. It's enough people to fill Fenway Park. We're crammed under a bridge in Texas September heat, itching to break through the border. It was a humanitarian crisis caused by Biden's broken border policies. And of course, Border Patrol had to go in and clean up Joe's mess. In the process of doing their actual job, something the rest of this White House knows nothing about, pictures circulated online of them containing the situation. Since they were on horseback, naturally, they had the reins of their horses in their hands. It didn't take long for the left-wing media to hatch a hoax, falsely accusing them of whipping Haitians. There is more outrage tonight after disturbing images showed Border Patrol agents on horseback swinging what appeared to be horse reins. The images we saw from Del Rio are uh, painful to watch. It's painful, disgusted, I mean, outraged. Outrage over these images showing desperate migrants. Really shocking footage uh, that obviously horrified. Those searing images linger on. We certainly do. The administration, as cunning as they are dumb, ran with the hoax and attacked their own employees. Due process be damned. Kamala Harris said this reminded her of slavery because everything reminds her of slavery. There needs to be consequence and accountability. It also evoked images of some of the worst moments of our history, where that kind of behavior has been used against the indigenous people of our country, has been used against African Americans during times of slavery. The images reminded Mayorkas of slavery, too. What are the chances? Using us in terms of what they suggest and what they conjure up in terms of not only our nation's history, but unfortunately the fact that that page of history has not been turned entirely. Notice how this has nothing to do with slavery at all, but Democrats see this and think of slavery. I didn't see this and think of slavery, did you? The party that fought a civil war to keep their slaves still to this day sees slavery everywhere, like a Rorschach test. They all need to see shrinks. And Joe Biden, who isn't embarrassed by Hunter, his approval ratings or the dreadful scenes at the Kabul airport, finally found something to be embarrassed by. But it was horrible what to see, as you saw. To see people treat it like they did, horses barely running them over, people being strapped, it's outrageous. I promise you, those people will pay. They will be an investigation underway now, and there will be consequences. There will be consequences. It's an embarrassment, but it's beyond an embarrassment. Biden is embarrassed when Border Patrol agents do their job and secure the border. And these agents will pay for doing their job. Nobody does their job well in the Biden administration and gets away with it. There will be.